Okay, so it's French day here at the shop and we are working on our Citroen. This is our truckette. It's a 1963. He's been aptly named Anton. So, um, came in. He's got a little dent on his hood there. Uh, not running. Hasn't been running for a few years. The customers were frustrated. I sorted out a bunch of different non-related items to make him run. Um, I'll take a look at his little engine here. So, um, he's a pretty rare guy in the United States. Oh, this is always hard to do one handed. Okay, there we go. You can tell how thin these this hood is. All the sheet metal on this car is that way. Let me get the prop rod, set it on my head here, and put it into a little bushing that's right there. That's where that goes. There we go. So uh, as I was saying about the sheet metal on this car, it's all really light. Very neat little truckette. Has a carrying capacity, I'm told, of 500 pounds. 500 pounds, that's like two people. So if you're looking at the engine here, what you're looking at, it's funny. So it's a single little tiny carburetor. This is the intake tube. This is the exhaust tube. The exhaust comes over and warms the bottom of the carburetor, merges with the other cylinder, and creates a Y pipe down. It's air cooled, of course, and if you look in there, you could actually hand crank it. It's a very simple, simple little car. It's a 425 cc. Some people say it's 12 horsepower, some people say 15, I don't know. But it's all there. That's the whole thing. Inboard drums, right there, drum brakes. The starter right here. <laughs> That's how you start it. You just pull this cable. It's got a little choke, little carburetor, a little six volt positive, I'm sorry, negative ground system. There's the battery. Let's go take Anton for a drive. I want to show you a few things first. So uh, he is a truckette. I'll show you the back here. The little barn doors in the back. Open, let's see, like that all the way so you can get your bread and bagels and baguettes and maybe your beignets in there. It's a nice little storage area. Shut that. Of course it has uh, flip up windows. This window is open. And the windows hinge right here and just kind of pops in this grommet to keep the window up. And we've got suicide doors. We're going to start them up. Oh I love these seats that have the little cords. That is your seat cushion. Okay, so you're sitting behind the dash here, and what you do, simply you turn the key to on. See the red light come on there, and the fuel gauge rise. And then underneath the dash, in two places, there's the D, which in French means start, I'm pretty sure. You would pull that out, which engages the starter. And on this side here is your choke. She's warmed up, so we're just going to pull the choke. fired right up. And if you look at the gear pattern here, the gear shifter actually comes out of the dash and it's just like like this. So you would push it in for reverse, pull it back for first, in again for second, out for third. She's running. We're gonna um, shut the hood and if you notice, I've got my camera mount in the window here Let's go take it for a little drive. This thing is a hoot to drive. So let me shut her up, get her prepared, and we'll go for a little drive. All right there, welcome to Anton. He's a 1963 2CV truckette. We're gonna go for a little drive. Now what we're gonna do, turn the key on so the light comes on. I'm gonna shut this window so you can probably hear me a little better. Notice how the windows flip? And then we're just going to pull the starter. Starts right up. Horn right there. We got wipers here. Turn signals. Of course, we can open the vent here if we wanted to. It's kind of cold out today. So we're going to go. You ready? Hang on. Emergency brake is off. There we go. Mail 
time. So I'm a male lady. Doesn't have a lot of power, but makes up for it in spirit, character. A ton of fun. Rocks and rolls. Floats along. We don't tip over. <laughs> oh, what a hoot. Oh. That was funny French. Thanks for riding along, and Anton is going to go back to his owner now.